Now, it is exactly one week to the 11th edition of the Standard Chartered International Marathon. But Limo Karone is not among the athletes preparing to contest for the 1.5 million shillings winner's prize. Instead, he is fundraising in between his training schedules as he wants to take part in a race in Panama. Victor Gale is next with Limo's story of undying spirit. <laughs> The towering athlete has been attempting to break into the lucrative races and that is why he sets out to the valleys of Ngong where he trains, covering over 30 kilometers daily. His aim is to take part in the IMS Panama International Marathon in November. In 2002, Ngong ni msuri wa kimbiaji, wanatoka Eldoret, wanatoka everywhere, wanatrenia kule Ngong kwa mana Ngong ni kwa high altitude. He is not short of talent, but his pockets have not supported his initiative. Initially, he thought the sit in the sun would solve all his problems, but the worst was yet to happen. Life was hard for Limo, who made fellow athletes with similar or worse predicaments, and together they had to literally team up in a bid to beat the hard times and hopefully realize his dream. Tukaenda internet, tukacharubu kuomba races. Nikaonelea injisa kama South America, Panama, Urkwe, na Barkwe, na Brazil. We sought to know why he is not taking part in some of the road races being organized in the country as the prize monies may help change his financial situation. Tuko wakimbia chwengi. Na yeye unesa kimbia ukwata namba kumi, namba twenty, na ukwata namba miambili. We are good run na kuapa Kenya. Despite Kenya being an athletics powerhouse, Joel Karone Limo is among the thousands of athletes who suffer in silence despite being talented. Victor Ogale, KTN Sports.